Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Christ has risen! The Lord has risen indeed! Hallelujah! Uh <laughs> Hello, boys and girls! Happy, happy Easter to all of you! Welcome to the Church of the Mediator Lenten series, which now we have moved to Easter. I keep saying hallelujah over and over again. I just feel the joy of Easter, the awesomeness of Jesus coming back, basically saying to everybody, I told y'all, come on, God is good. I hope you've all had a wonderful Easter, whether it was here at the Mediator, or at another church, or even at your home. It was a glorious day everywhere. I can't remember the last time I've seen a more beautiful Easter Sunday. And how wonderful God is. You know, Christmas, Christmas is a super special time of year. We receive the gift of hope through the birth of Jesus. And I love Christmas. But you know, Easter... Easter is major. I mean, we've watched Jesus grow up. And then, you know, he teaches us all these lessons. He teaches people. He leads people. People follow him. And then he finds himself alone in the desert. And people are hating him. And, and then he's betrayed by his friends. And, and then eventually he dies a, a very sad death. But then the miracle happens an actual miracle he is alive you know that day I always think about his friends you know watching that happen to him on the cross and then all of a sudden he, he's alive again it, that must have really freaked out so the day you know this women went to the tomb to check on things and he, he wasn't there and they were like crying and freaking out which of course so they go and they find Jesus's friends and they're all kind of in this safe place because you know they're still afraid I mean these people you know put Jesus on a cross I mean they didn't know what was going to happen to them and so they go to the room and they're like oh my gosh it, uh, Jesus is not there he's not in the tomb and they're like what I mean there's so many emotions going on I mean they were just like he's alive he's alive but they were still scared. I mean, this had to scare people a little bit. I mean, they were just like, did somebody drag them off? Or what'd they do? Well, suddenly, Jesus just walked in the room. Can you imagine? I bet they were all like, what? He walked in and he probably knew they were gonna be afraid. So he came in and he would he breathed, breathed peace upon all of them. Like, calm down, it's okay. I know this is crazy, but this is me. I'm Jesus. You know, look look at my hands. You know, they had he had wounds in his hands for where they put him on the cross. He was like, it's me, but it's okay. So they all kind of calmed down. You know, they felt the peace. They felt the love. It, Jesus was so powerful. He just radiated all those feelings. And he looked at all his friends and he was like, it's good. It's all right. Peace be with you. Wow. I mean, I just can imagine the celebration that they all had. They all felt. I mean, Jesus was alive. They watched a miracle. Everything promised to them was true. God did send this man down. God does love us so much that Jesus went through all that to show us. Goodness me, I mean, it showed us that no matter what we're going through, as sad as we might be, in the end, we're going to know God loves us. It's the miracle of Easter. And you know what, boys and girls? Easter should go with you all year. We are people of Easter. We are people that believe in Jesus. We believe in God. We are the people that knows that God loves us no matter what. And you know, He tells us He loves all people. He does not care where you are from. He does not care what color you are. He doesn't care what anybody does for a living. He just wants the people to know 
the people of the world, the people of Easter, that He loves us. And all He wants is for you to love Him back. He loved us so much that He sent Jesus. Jesus went out to share the love of God. He was like, this is what I've been trying to tell you all. Jesus taught us, you just have to love. You just have to know that God loves you. What a wonderful, wonderful blessing Easter is. And a blessing to be a part of the people of Easter. All of you are just like Jesus, boys and girls. Brave, full of love. All of you are. I see it in all your faces. I just want to keep shouting. Alleluia! Alleluia! It's so exciting. It's so fun. And I can't wait to celebrate Easter. Not just Easter Sunday. Not even just the week after Easter. But for the whole year, I'm going to celebrate Easter. Because I am part of the people of Easter. I know God loves me. I know Jesus died to save all of us. And that makes me and you very, very, very lucky. Boys and girls, I hope that you all had a wonderful Easter. I have loved spending this time with you during this Lenten series. It's always good to share God's love. I hope to see you all again real soon. Now, before we do go, let's bow our heads. Lord, thank you so much for Easter. Thank you for giving us Jesus. Thank you for bringing him back so we can be reminded of the miracle of Easter. How much you love us. Help us carry that love throughout all we do every day. Amen. Boys and girls, I have the best memories of this past Sunday. Seeing so many of your faces. I'm going to carry the memory of the love of Easter with me for many, many weeks to come. But we're still celebrating Easter, boys and girls. So happy Easter to each and every one of you. Thank you for being here and Alleluia! See you real soon.